same place. Two. Yeah. Three. Yeah. One. Two. Three. Hey, where's the three? Again. One. Two. Three. Yeah. So, um, we're gonna do crossover footwork. Just a little bit go over again. So when you start from here, right? And then let's say the ball is coming all the way over here and you want to play the forehand. If we do one step to get there, to loop, it's too late. We, it's too huge jump that we cannot get there on time. So the way we design to catch the far forehand wide one is to split into two steps. One is getting ready and that small step actually goes towards the ball. And from here, you will decide how far you need to jump depending on your return, right? So here, you swing first using the body rotation, and then you will land right, left, in your case. Left-handed, right? In, in right-handed player, it will be left and right. So show me. Yeah. So let's see. Start from small. Put your pedal down here. So I want you to play with, the, uh, with your hand. So, oh, watch, watch. Don't, don't hit my hand too hard. Just like try to think about your spinning, right? And prepare from there. So show me one, two, two, and then course of forward. Yeah, go back, same place, two, yeah. Stay, 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 wait, 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 wait. One, two, yeah. So did you see, you started from there, you can still catch my hand all the way over here. So this can cover really the whole table. Okay, so very important footwork. Let's work on this a little bit. So starting on the backhand corner. So we're gonna start already from here. Oh no, no, up, 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 yeah. Body turn a little bit more, ready to jump. I'm gonna give you far, yeah, ready? Yeah, a little bit more spinny. Yeah, again. Don't rush. A little bit. Wait for the contact point. That's when you take off, right? Wait. Yeah. Mm. What happens if you start too early? You're not going to be able to control the distance, right? You, re you were ready to go for far one, and if the ball ended up coming to your middle, then you got jammed. Okay? So always wait, and then you take off. Yeah. More spinny, wait, wait for the point. Yeah, wait. Very good. Uh huh. Very good. Yeah, yeah, not this one. Okay. Very good. Wow, nice. Wow. <laughs> yeah. So you can start from the backhand side. I gave you to actually wide forehand corner. You can still catch and play the shot. Okay. Now, so when do we use this is when they push to your backhand side, you can do backhand loop or forehand loop. But when you commit with your forehand loop on the backhand side, we're leaving the forehand side open, right? So high chance when you play the ball, they're gonna play it back to your forehand because that's empty. You just committed. But because we are afraid of them blocking back to your empty corner, and we, if we don't turn and try to loop on this one, even though when you have good chance, like the ball was good enough for you to actually use a forehand loop, to attack, we play defensive, and that's what they want, right? They want you to play defensive on the backhand so they can attack first. So instead of de playing defensively, we want to move and loop first. And even if we do that, and even if they push or they block it back to your forehand side, we know how to work it to make the shot, okay? If you have this footwork, you are not afraid turning in the corner and then do a forehand loop. But if you don't know how to do this footwork, it's really hard to commit to your backhand side with the forehand loop. If you do, you can, if you make the shot, they block it, you're, you're done. 
right? So let's start from here. One, two, three, four, five. Let me show you. Start from here. One, on the spin loop. Two, three. And then wait. Four, five. Okay. Show me. One, two, three. No, this, the rhythm is one. Two, three. Two, three is right away. Okay, go back, go back, go back. From here. One, two, three. Four. Yeah. Again. No, no, no. Uh, here. One, two, three, four. Yeah. This two, three, remember, you don't need to stay here. Two, three, can, you can little bit go towards inside back to where you were. One, two, three. Yeah. Very good. So do under spin forehand loop and then show me one, two, three, wait, and then loop. Huh. Two, three. Hey, where's the three? Again. That's okay. One, two, three. Where's the three? Automatic. Again. One, two, three. Again. Smooth. It's simple. One, two. One, two, three. Yeah. Yeah. One, two, three. Very good. One, two, three. Hey, yeah. Again. One, two, three. Very good. Uh huh. One, two, three. Uh huh. One, two, three. Yeah. One, two, three. Eight. Again. One, two, three. Eight. Again. One, two, three. Yeah. One, two, three. Mm -hmm. One, two, three. One, two, again. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Uh -huh. Again. Two, three. Again. One, two, three. Again. Two, three. Mm -hmm. So, actually, for us to make that two, three step towards back to your place, we need to create a little bit more space from the beginning. Does it make sense? So you make that up, you adjust by going a little bit in. If you get jammed here, actually you, we need to do something like that and we cannot move in. Few more, three more, let's go. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Okay. 